Hello everyone, welcome back to another edition of Jay's Minecraft Explorations 1.15.2. Yes, we have upgraded. Alright, let's clear this out. Now, remember last time we were talking about we were going to head back. And the reason being is I wanted to collect up a stone and sand to work on that base. Um, the Prismarine Farm. Well... Let's leave the leather here, and I think what I'm going to do is we're going to head back to the main house, the one with the, uh, okay, scary noise, <laughs> the uh, house with the, with that one thing. And we're going to do that, so let's start heading back now. Now, don't worry, we'll come back here. Okay, not a big deal. I already know the coordinates, so we're good. Let's start heading back. So, we're going to connect that nether portal up. That's going to be our next mission. Now, last time since we met, we were talking about trying to find a beehive. Well, guess what they've done in Minecraft? Now you can spawn in beehives. Like, if you were to... Grow a set of oak or, I think it's what they say, oak or spruce trees. Not spruce. Oak or birch trees. And if there's a flower, like, within two, two blocks from it, we supposedly supposed to have a beehive. All right, well, that's good. That's good news. That is good news. So you remember all those flowers that I had removed from that little tree farm back by the Prismarine farm? Well, <laughs> I gotta put all those back. That's okay though. So what I'm gonna do today is head back to the main farm. And then we'll have some fun. I don't know if I can make it there in one sitting because we are pretty far from it. We'll probably work on some cabins on the way there. As a matter of fact, we have shears, but no space. Oh, I've got a birch sapling I could drop off. Well, we'll see where we're at here. We'll just keep going and see what we can do. At this point now, we have a lot of cabins. Matter of fact, if I were just to keep heading straight, we can head on a sub-origin, we can find a cabin. So yeah, they've been uh, adding new stuff. They fix a bug in my resource pack uh, for my doors and my clock now. They, had, they added a new feature for shading for the little hotbar, or the GUI. So I ended up managing to learn how to do that. It wasn't too bad. So I retrofitted my old resource pack that I've made. And it was like from 1.10 or something like that to 115.2. So that wasn't too terribly painful. All right. Now I don't see anything out here. Where are we at here? All right. So we're not too far. Is that sand, smooth sandstone? Matter of fact, we got about what? We got another 2,500 blocks or something. We're going to have to make some cabins. That's okay, though. The more cabins, the better. Of course, I hear a whole uh, Discord going off, but I'm too lazy to get up, and two, I'm filming this, so I can't just get up right now and be like, oh, look at me. So, that's just how things are. We're going to keep going. Now, I remember there was a cabin kind of like a makeshift cabin around here somewhere. I 
kind of funny really we've been all over this game we haven't really been over that way we've been over this way pretty much so but I did save the coordinates for the nether now we can just go in there and find out where we're at would be really good obviously you can tell I haven't been this way At least we're in a desert. Well, I mean, if I really need a stock of sand, here we go. Let's see. We got some nice turtles. They won't do me any good. You better run away. Oh, uh oh. I'm going to punch you. Okay, where are we at now? Alright, I think I'm heading in the wrong direction. Uh, I think we're supposed to go this way. I haven't been out here in so long. Alright, let's see here. Okay, I think I'm supposed to go back over here. Alright, let's go this way. I'm heading in the wrong direction. Matter of fact, I was going negative. <laughs> Whoops. My bad. Well, we've already uh, burning up some daylight. Maybe we'll start building a little makeshift cab. Matter of fact, I haven't seen anything out here. So. That's why I want to get the nether hub working so I don't have to deal with this. There we go. So I've been kind of thinking about some new tutorials for Minecraft, some stuff that may be a little more interesting. I notice all of my tech stuff really does very well, so we'll do more of those. I've got a couple of things I like to do, and I see a ship down there, but I'm completely maxed out, so I can't just go in and scarf the stuff out of that. And yay, it looks like we're going to be doing lots of swimming today. We just came from this way, but we're going to have to go back. So what did I waste, like five minutes swimming in the wrong direction? But at least uh, we got some scenery to look at, not like the old version of Minecraft where it was just water and gravel. And that was it, and squid. Now we have fishies and and pretty uh, seaweed and, and kelp that grows on the bottom and all that stuff. Oh, scared the living daylight side. It's like, what? What the heck was that? Oh, there's a ravine down there. All right, we'll see if we can get our cell. Let's see if we can get our bearings here. Where are we at now? Okay. We're going to have to head back that way, huh? Well, why did anybody tell me? All right, here we go. Honestly, after a while, I mean, the cabins are pretty cool, but I'm getting kind of bored of building them, so uh, we're going to have to find a place to camp, or we're going to have to walk in the dark. Well, I'm kind of in a hurry right now, and there's no sheep. If you notice, I haven't seen anything in here. It's almost like my game is stuck in peaceful mode. I'll guarantee we're going to see lots of mobs. Oh, yeah. I can't even pick any of that up, sadly.
Uh oh. I'm out of here. Oh yes, my swimming. Well, I guess we have to go in. I mean, at least I grew a brain this time and wrote down all the coordinates, but it doesn't do any good when you head in the wrong direction. That's why I wish this was like the bedrock where you can put the coordinates in the um, top left and you can see them. Because I don't like showing my stats menu. I just think that's kind of tacky and making a seamless gameplay. Oh, yes. It's nighttime. We're swimming. More boring swimming. More water. Yeah, that's... When we get the nether thing going, we don't have to go through this. So what is this? Night one? At least I can somewhat stand here. Let's see where we're at. Okay. So we're about, again, 2,500 blocks. Actually, about 2,200 blocks away. We're in the right direction. Now, I know that there's some um, cabins on that origin, so... Get back to one of those cabins, I'll be fine. <sighs> Let's see, what can we talk about? There's actually nothing new with COPPA this time. They haven't... Uh, of course, by the time you're watching, this is probably in March. So it's hard to... Uh-oh. Let me get that dolphin to help me out. There we go. Come on, baby, just swim it. Now we're making good time. I can tell I've, I haven't been here. Uh, but my main channel is slowly climbing back up. Apparently, I guess a lot of toy collectors are quitting YouTube. And I refuse to be defeated. Look at all those mobs. We got another six minutes of nighttime left. Now, if we, ran, we swam a marathon, what are we doing now? Avoiding getting shot. Keep my eyes peeled for cabins. Maybe that's one right there. It's pretty bright. Oh. It's just a lava bath. Nothing special. We want to avoid that over there. Oh, yeah. I don't feel like getting shot at. <laughs> so we're about 1,500 blocks away. get up here and we can see what's going on. We should be getting to the origin where we can... Uh-oh. I don't want to deal with him. Wow, okay. 
the heck was that? <laughs> I've been sleeping, so I know it's not those phantoms. I don't know what the heck that was. You all heard that. I don't know if it was one of those foxes or whatever, but it was pretty creepy. But every time there's they update Minecraft, it's something there you don't see every day. Every time they update Minecraft, they always add some spooky stuff to it. Well, I don't think this game is rated for little children because, well, we're going to have to go up and over. Just walk right past them. We don't even have to run. We can walk right past them because they're slow. Hmm, that'd be a good place to hide right there for the night. So, I'm going to need to gather a whole lot of stone for that Prismarine farm. So, what i got to do is I'd like to... I, and the reason why I don't want... I didn't explain this in the last episodes. The reason why I don't want to mine stone around that farm is... This, oh, wow. Never mind. Hold on. Um, is... Oh, that's a witch hut. Is because I don't want to... Uh, have mobs spawn underground around it. Matter of fact, we're going to have to do a lot of backfilling if there's caves under all that. I can tell you right now, we haven't explored this. Swampity swamp, swamp, swamp. So yeah, the, the beehives now can spawn in more locations, but it's just trying to find them. Yeah, because you just don't want those uh, mobs to spawn. We only want the gardens to spawn in a certain radius, so that's what I'm hoping for. Well, at least it's morning. <laughs> we got another, what, two minutes left or something like that before and the mobs will go away. By that time, we'll probably find a cabin. Uh-oh, hold on. i got to deal with something being silly. Alright, everything wants to kill me now. Are you really going to chase me? Oh man, I got those little kids after me, those little kid zombies. I want to try to get some slime balls. Oh. I guess that won't happen. All right. So not a whole lot has changed on my end. I've been working on building instructions like crazy. Uh, trying to get everything done. Seems like that's the main thing now I've been focusing on. I don't want to see where I'm at now. We got sheep, so I could possibly make a bed. So we should be close to cabin if that's if I can get around holes and trenches and things I can fall in and break my ankle type deal so heading this way there should be a cabin because I put a bunch on the origin here So today is pretty much heading back to the main, the main homestead. Maybe we'll keep our eyes peeled for a, a beehive. And yes, I will drop something for it. But I did try to spawn a beehive in on my server, and I did get one to successfully spawn with the flower trick. 
However, there was no bees in it, so that would be a showstopper there. Yeah, I'm also just make it back to the cabin, huh? Of course, I'm going to be starving. So, I need to get a lot of sand. Uh, got sponges back at that thing. I didn't bring any of those back. Okay, that's good, because I want to keep those over there. And... Oh, you don't want to fall down in there. <laughs> that's for sure. Uh, that, would not have, that would not have turned out well. Okay, I should start seeing cabins out here. Making sure. I'm trying to check. I think I'm lost again. And yes, I know I built the cabins. I think, I hope. Uh, I don't know. <laughs> Pretty soon, every sub origin will have cabins everywhere and then you just be able to find one real quick and it'll go really the game will go quick once we get the nether hub going it'll we don't we only have to spend maybe five minutes to get to our destination wow I don't see anything here where are we at now Alright, I'm getting close, about 400 blocks away. I should be seeing something out here. Get back, we'll start uh, making a big massive oak tree farm. And then what we'll do is we'll see if we can get a beehive to spawn. Now, it doesn't mean bees will spawn in there, but if we get a hive, then I can just lure bees back if I have to. I kind of wish we were swimming again, because at least it was open and I didn't have to stop and have to constantly jump and all that stuff. Let's see if we can get over this hill here. So don't worry, we're still going to build that mansion. Ah, that's not what I wanted to see. Ah. <sighs> Let's see, I don't know. I'm I'm really lost. <laughs> Here we go again. First, what ten minutes and I'm already lost. We won't be lost once I could find a cabin. Alright, so And yeah, that campfire does pretty good as a marker, but when you can't even see where you're at. Yeah, let's get on the top of these trees, even if you're not technically... Even know if you would really fall through this. Uh-huh. I was hoping that would be one. Can I pick that up? Um, let's just set that there. We may need that later on. I don't like to waste things. I 
punch the squid. I blame that squid because I'm lost. I had to blame something to make me feel better. Alright, no bed, nothing. Watch this file got corrupted and all my houses were wiped clean. Oh, that that suck. That would not be cool at all. The sworder would have been a run around here somewhere. Oh, wow. Look at all the creepers and stuff down there. Oh, wait a minute. There we are. I don't to see the cabin, but I do see the smoke. So I guess we can hang out here. That means the other one's right over there. And the sun is slowly going down. And I don't think this one has a bed. We're going to check. We're going to check it and see. If not, we're going to head. I'd like to start getting these to work and stuff. Mm, it does have a bed. Uh, we got stuff to make the roof. Let's just start working on this cabin. I mean, it's just kind of sitting here. And... Okay. I mean, why not? I'm overflowed. Uh, some of you are probably like, no, Jay, please, no more cabins. I can't take those anymore. They're boring. Well, we need some shelter. Bedroom is the most important place. We need our sleep, so we gotta get that done first. Yeah, that's why it's taking forever, huh? Okay. So we're gonna hang out here for one night. We really need to get these cabins going out here. And once we get it done, we're... Wow, there's really nothing out here, is there? <laughs> Means we can start getting the walls done. I want to pick up the sand, though. Let me put the sand in there. So there's absolutely no back wall on this. Well, we could fix that real quick. We just don't want, we don't want some creepy thing coming in here. Killing us while we're sleeping. Alright. Alright, so it looks really good. So basically this is our second game day. Plug these up real quick. All right. I was talking about I didn't do that right there. And there's some up there, and I can't get to them. I'm gonna go OCD if I don't pick that up. There we go. No, he's safe. Saved by the bed. Third game day, and yeah, now I got the nice slopes to put on this house. I guess I could focus on this cabin a little bit here. All right, so let's get going here. So now what I want to do is, uh-oh, let's get out of here. 
start collecting these flowers because we're going to need them for the trees. So I think I have a good place for a tree farm. And you guessed it. On top of that mom farm we built at the other base, which we're trying to head there now. You can see it right there. And there's the other house right over there. Good. We're not totally lost. We just wasted two game days, but that's okay. Still need to get more sandstone. Now I kind of wish I could take that nasty old uh, prismarine bricks off and put the uh, other stuff in there. Oh, wow, look at all that. Well, we know that's working. Okay, we don't have... Well, I need more than just this. I'm going to need to grow my trees over there. So I'm going to make on top of that a tree farm. I may end up hiding that, too, and making a mountain or something out of it. Home sweet home. Okay, we know Daisy's over there. We didn't forget about her. Left the door open too, or somebody came in and burglarized my house. I don't know. Alrighty, let's see. That's where we're at right now. So, turtle eggs. That's right, we need to get ourselves some turtles. So, what do I want to do is, let's put that in there. We're going to get a bunch of oak saplings. Let's grab the flowers. We're going to start putting flowers on top of that. Normally, I shear the sheep for the attic. Well, guess what? I, uh... Well, I don't have enough. I don't even see an Enderman in there. Okay. okay, let's start planting trees like crazy. Yes, I'm just throwing them down. all those flowers. Probably thinking, why, Jay? Well, we need that beehive. That's why. <laughs> I need that beehive bad, and it's not going to do any good. I mean, we can get one with bees would be nice, but... And if I like, if I don't like this, I can just remove it. It's not permacraft. be my beehive farm. Okay, let's go do our shearing. I think it was light blue. Okay, you know what to do, sheep. You know where I'm coming for. Looks like all I got is teal. Oh no, I don't. Okay, now. There's one 
over there. I probably already got her, but let's do her again. Okay. So now, we're back home. Uh, what I'm thinking of doing is we need to get back inside the nether. Go back to those cords as best we can, pretty close, and see if we can actually add ourselves. Oh, I'm already getting lost in my own house. See if we can add more of that stuff. No, that didn't get too. That didn't. Well, those sheep are pretty stingy. They don't even give you a lot. All right. Oh uh, yeah. We need to fix this up. want to keep that there because I want to replace this stuff here okay. take a shortcut oh look we already got a few trees up there huh I don't see any beehives. Maybe I shouldn't have put them on there. You want to come out here and follow me? These zombies are so silly. You going? You want to come after me? Okay. If you want, I mean, go right ahead. I can't stop you. See, if I want to make this a heal, just start doing it like that and building it up. Let's grab some yellow. I think the other day, well, not the other day, when we were last here, we were kind of bone milling this area. I mean, I'm literally going to cake that thing up there with flowers, and we're just going to hope that a beehive spawns. It may not be bees in it, but at least we'll get a hive. Yeah, looking like a forest up here now. And if I need wood, I'll just chop one of these down and I'll be on my way. Okay. All right, let's see what we can do here. We do need more clay, huh? Okay, we've already harvested the farm. Blah, blah, blah. do this. We'll cook more stone. As far as, we well, you know what, well, we got this stuff here. We can always go back and work on that one cabin. Let's throw this in here. And we'll cook that up first. And then for stone, for a storm, a stone farm, we'll just go downstairs. Like at level five, we'll just mine that out like crazy. And that's what we'll do. So for the extra prismarine and the lanterns and stuff, we'll just use those probably light this house up. I'll just set some lights in here and look really cool. So let's see here. Maybe a beehive over there. Take that flower. These are your cheap garden variety flowers. Nobody cares about. I mean, there may not be a beehive up there. Let's 
think those mees would he be here now. But I don't see them yet. I'm gonna have to put these in a grid formation. Maybe plant saplings every, uh, I don't know, maybe every uh, five blocks or something like that. Put a lot of flowers in there. We need to make a really good, efficient beehive farm. Let's go to bed real quick. Rise and shine. Here we go. Let's get back now. What do I want to do? I can go in the nether or I can mine more stone. Uh, let's see. I could just mine some stone. Let's empty out some junk out of my drawers real quick. Let's put all this in here. Okay, so, yeah, maybe we can. Okay, well, I guess we can go into the nether. So we got to go back to negative, what is it, two, negative 200 by negative 300. Uh, we could. Yeah, let's go for it. That's not too far. Now, let's see here. How do we get down from here again, huh? Oh, there we go. So we need to go back this way here. Now, the best way I can do this is to keep this at level 32. We can build bridges and stuff. So we need to go back that way. But let's just start hitting this out now. Need to head up to like 370 something. Uh, I mean, I don't care about the nether, anyways. It's kind of trashed up, anyways. Uh, let's make ourselves a little catwalk over this. I didn't want to put that there. All right. I don't know what's worse, those zombies moaning or that gas. Have plenty of roof slopes for the for the roof of the house. We've almost got all that done anyways. So when we get done with this, we're gonna have to hang a left. Lessons learned. Stand far away. Okay, so that's as far as we got. That's okay. At least now I can walk somewhere now. something over this. Matter of fact, I'm supposed to drop this portal down anyways. So. We'll throw some of that in there. Um, we'll just pack that in really good. And we'll go downstairs real quick. Oh, I need to get some more of that. You know, still... 
I'm still getting comments about why am I still using stone tools. It's like, use the diamonds, Jay. Use those diamonds. I want to use the diamonds for the cool stuff like the armor. And I need to find mending and stuff. I don't want to just waste them. <laughs> I mean, I know they're not doing any good inside the... In my inventory, but still, I know, it's just kind of wasteful. Okay, I got my clock in here. This is like the fourth game day, so I got one more after this. Okay, which way are we supposed to go now? I'm kind of lost in here. I'm getting lost in my own hole. Uh-oh. Don't be shooting! Could have got me killed down here. Whoops. Didn't want to use that. Stone mine. This is where I'm going to mine out all the cobble. You know what? We're going to pull the gold out of here now. You know, if it's useless, we'll find a use for it. I wish they'd make like uh, golden lanterns and stuff that just, they're decorative, but, you know, just for fun. Yeah, so we're still looking for those ender pearls. Oh. Well, well, well now. We got silk touch. Let's just pull those out of there. We don't want those getting stolen now, do we? You know, if this is a single player game. Okay. At least we got some lava. Yeah, someday we'll finish up that little farmhouse. Eh, another nuisance. Just keep mining this area out here. Maybe we'll get lucky and find more goodies. I doubt it, but... Now I wonder if those beehives will spawn like in a bee... like underground. Tag, okay, you're it. That's some villager money right there. Matter of fact, we need to find ourselves a priest. <laughs> so he can bless our... So he can bless our... Our, uh... Whatchamacallit? Our rotten flesh. Turn it into emeralds so they can buy more things we don't need. Now there's a village not too far from here that we can check out. How are we doing on time? All right. Let's put that in there right there. That's more desirable. Look at all that grown over there. I think I'm going to put a mob farm in there. I think that'll be perfect. Then we can get ourselves a music disc farm. So I'm going to throw something together. We got some slime balls. We'll have to make a sticky piston. So I think what we'll do is we're going to put some rooms in. Uh, I may do it right here. One will be a shooting gallery for the for the old skeleton.
take the eggs. I know probably some are watching these are probably going, oh, he just runs back and forth. He doesn't do anything while I'm preparing for the big kill, which is the dragon, the big defeat. Oh, I see an Enderman there. You know what? I don't have no place safe to even kill him. I don't see any beehives yet. I'm gonna need to get some more dirt. Boy, look at all the creepers in there. You know how many music discs we could get out of that if we can get all those harnessed out of there? In fact, if I can get that Enderman. Oh, I better not do that. I wonder if he can see me if I go right here. Nah, probably not. No, you're trespassing, huh? Now it's time for Betty Buys. Alright, Rise and Shine, last game day, and well, we were talking about making a shooting gallery and stuff for the skeleton that we can get in there. We still need to get a name tag. I may have one. Let me put this in here. Put those sea lanterns in there too and those. And I'm a little overflowed on things. I need to get some dirt. Hold on. Let's see if I got any dirt downstairs. Well, I'm walking like I'm all not all there today. I'm gonna make a room with a little hole in it. So the zombies. Why did I go that way? You know, so the zombies can't attack me, but I can go after the Endermen. I'd like to figure out a way to do it, though, somehow. I'm going to do it here. I bet you probably could. I had a skeleton here. I get these creepers out here. Kill him. Okay, I'm gonna have to go in there and get that. It'd be nice to get the to get a chamber in here. You know what the other side's actually better. Um, let's say this is a shooting gallery here. If we put it right here. And usually what you have to do is you have to run through here. I always like to go five blocks. This is just going to be rough. So five right here. Looks like my game's a bit laggy. Oh, here's another, here's another good story. I'm getting a few friends of mine nagging about me not getting a 
up-to-date, most recent, expensive 2080 graphics card for my PC. And, you know, I have other obligations to, you know, money-wise, you know, I have bills to pay and stuff like that. I don't have my parents to buy me things. I have to do that all myself. And one of the things that I don't get is when people complain about it, they always say, well, why don't you uh, buy me a graphics card and that'll make everyone happy. And they're like, why would I give you money for a graphics card? I'm like, because you're complaining about it. You know. If you're going to complain about it, shouldn't you give me one? You know, I've only, that only makes sense, right? So if I was the skeleton sitting here, I'm going to shoot right here. I don't want to put a block here. So there'll be a gate, maybe a slab or something. But I have to find a name tag first. Okay. See, now what I'm going to do is start chopping down trees. And that pretty much should be about it. So well, this game day is kind of dry, but there's a skeleton down there. Okay. Now if there's a beehive, we'd slurp that up. So what I'm going to do is start gridding this thing with flowers for maximum performance. Something like that, and you put your tree right in the middle of these. So... Yeah, and everybody wants, you can tell when it's a, a younger viewer, they want your Minecraft videos to be in 4K at, I don't know, 240 frames per second. And I'm like, why? You know, it's an old school game. It's not meant to be 4K, but some of them, they want that. One, two, three, flop. Okay, so now I'm just going to make a grid. Let's start really planting trees in here. Put that right in the middle. Now it doesn't look like a hosh posh full of mess. I don't really want to move that. And we can decorate this up and make it look really good later. So each one of these flowers, I think, increases it by 5%. So just imagine, there's got to be at least one flower by the... So if we check and there's a tree there and it has a, a thing on it, it would be cool. I think the beehive is going to be tougher than the ocean monument. may want to stick with one type of flower. I may do that because these, these ones here, these uh, azure things, these, work, these look really good. And we'll just dump the other ones. <laughs> Let's 
just says it has to be a flower. It didn't specifically say what flower we need. You can always get the corn flower too. But it's a nice, that nice deep blue. And that would look really good. So now we'll call this the beehive. This will be our bee beehive farm, or we'll do that. We'll call it the beehive farm. There we go. These look a lot better and they're not as tall. Am I already overflowed? Oh yeah, this looks a lot better. Okay. Look at all the pretty little flowers. Yeah, but the whole graphics card incident, you know, because I don't play a whole lot of hardcore games. You know, that demand that. I may end up just setting up a GoFundMe page and be like, okay, you're complaining here. Go fund me. Yeah, I'm going to need to get more food. I don't think anybody's going to go fund me, but, you know, or... No, maybe make it a Patreon thing. If somebody requests it, say, you need a new graphics card, I'm going to be like, I'm not answering that until you become a Patreon supporter. <laughs> You know, get kind of brutal. And matter of fact, I'm still debating if I want to put my uh, resource packs on Patreon. It's a good hosting provider. All right, I think that's it. Not a whole lot going on here. Um, haven't seen any beef hives yet. It's about as thick as an Amazon jungle, I swear. So this is going to be our our B thing. We got to get this nice green grass over there too. So I need to see if I got any slime balls. We got to make a couple sticky pistons for doors. Redstone that. Very temporary. Very rough. Be nice to get ourselves some music discs for our cabins. I think in the next game day, or the next episode, we're going to tackle on working in the nether. Well, I guess I can dump that potato. Well, no, I guess I can't dump that potato, but I'm going to do it anyways. Alrighty. Put those apples in there. I need to organize this. In one of my other houses, I had a pantry uh, on another game, so I may do that. So that's it, everyone. Take care, and I'll see you in the next episode.